would look at these two rallies. So let's even three, like one, mm -hmm. two, and three. It seems to me that rally number three has the best character. Oh, I mean, not only in terms of you know the buying quality, it's about what should be happening uh, around areas of supply. So say this is the supply area. We come down here, we absorb our way through. Okay, that's fine. We get to the highs and around here, we have a little reaction, then we break on through here, Roman. We this is our absorption of this area here. I mean, wow! Look, we just don't give up any room. Uh, we don't give up anything really. Then we dip down, and obviously, you know, kind of testing action, and then we just break on through. We get onto the highs, and there's just no reaction. Uh, my mouse mm -hmm. like, uh, no reaction up here to me. And then we just break on through. It's just wow! It's so strong the way that we're doing that. Uh, yeah, again here, very different. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, for all those reasons, yeah, this this. So it's not only in terms of the buying quality is better; it's the selling not having an effect. You know. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so yeah. I um, I think that's an interesting concept here. Um, I mean, obviously not necessarily new, but duration of the absorption um, mm -hmm. shows to us uh, presence of supply. Yeah. Uh, or. Uh, ability of the demand um, it's usually both it's 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 never just one um, because even if supply is present demand could be present as well and it could be aggressive and absorption will happen faster so um, you usually have to kind of assess both uh, at the spot and if duration increases so you know that either supply is available so you could see from the volume signature yes supply is available or uh, you know, on a lower duration, you might say like, okay, well, supply is valuable, but 